Hey everybody, this is going to be a response video to my own video. A um, few days back I posted a video showing a, a lot of the how-tos in Mortal Kombat 4 for the PC. Um, unknown to me, I didn't realize that I was playing a patched version. I had had my copy of uh, Mortal Kombat backed up on a CD for so long that uh, you know all I ever did was drag and drop it because it always had my XP patch to get everything to play properly. So what I did for you guys is I broke out the old CD and did a fresh install for you guys and I'm going to show you how to get the the cheat, the hidden cheat menu and the hidden characters um, off of a fresh install with no patches. Um, we'll start with the cheat menu where you get the one button fatalities. It's just the same as what it was in my other video. The only difference is, is you just have to hold it a little bit longer or actually hold it instead of just tap it. Again, you just select or highlight where your difficulty setting is in the practice menu. And then you just press and hold, block and low kick. And then you wait to hear uh, a laugh in the background and then shortly thereafter the menu will pop up. I think it's about 15 seconds. And there you have the cheat menu. And like I said, it's still just block and low kick. You got your easy endings, easy fatalities and level fatalities and you know you turn them on accordingly. Now, uh, Noob and Goro, unfortunately, are just as hard as they were for the Dreamcast and, uh, and PlayStation and everything else. Um, and another thing, too, that I've found is that only one person can be a hidden character at a time on this. And I'm going to show you how to do it. You pick hidden with any button and then move to Rico or Shinnok. We'll do Rico, and then simply pick them with run and block. You don't have to hold it. You just got to pick them with run and block. That way you still be able to do your codes. And it didn't work for me. <laughs> Let's try that again. I think I took too long. Okay, pick hidden. We'll go up, up, left. And yeah, there's Noob Cybot. And like I said, all I did was tap them. I didn't hold them for any duration or anything like that. And uh, Goro's the same. He's just, um, you pick him with Shinnok. Up three, left one, and then pick with run and block. And then uh, choose your destiny. We should have Goro up there. All right. And the other hidden is meat. Meat is a little bit uh, more difficult to get in this, and it's almost pointless because of all the work you have to go through to get them. You're probably tired of playing the game by the time you do get them. There is no quick way to just select him. What you do is you come in here to your select and you have to pick two player game, pick group, and what you see here is it'll select your character for you, the first red box would be Kai, and eventually you go through all uh, 15 characters and once you go through the 15th character it'll let you select your character again and then whatever character you pick from then on will be meat. But once you exit out of the game you uh, lose meat and you have to do it all over again and there is no quick way to pick him. Now <clears throat> I'm gonna try to track down this patch that I got. Unfortunately I got it you know four or five years ago so I don't remember where I got it from. Um, I'll try to track it down and post it in the comments so you guys can get the, the patched version. And also I found in the patched version, whoever patched it had also added a very crude copy of Katana when you picked Sonya. You could get a, um, a version of Katana by doing the same method you would for uh, Rico or Shinnok. Um, but that's it. I hope this uh, solves any confusion that I gave anybody by the last video. I, I honestly thought that was the way all of them were until uh, I had a few people tell me that I was wrong. And But this is the correct way to get them. If you have any questions, post them in the comments. Thanks for watching.